There's a natural alliance between the interests of the reinsurance companies and the reinsurance industry and the type of science that BIOS either does here or has access to globally in order to be able to provide the kind of realistic understanding of what the risks are. And that's really the benefit of Bermuda is that in close proximity, you've got a very, very good marine research institution producing climate records of great value and you've got the basically the capital of the reinsurance industry on the planet. So it couldn't be finer. In the uh, 90s, following some major hurricanes, including Hurricane Andrew in Florida, the insurance industry realized that it didn't have a good handle on what the risk was from hurricanes and changing climate. And several of the reinsurance companies on island began working with bioscientists and the risk prediction initiative to better understand how the uh, oceans and hurricane formation of all the processes involved with it and better quantify the risk so that they had more rational understanding of how to set rates, what type of insurance they could provide. That has gone on quite successfully for many, many years. In fact, so successfully that many of the major companies have set up their own in-house climate science units in order to be able to do and reproduce what RPI had done for them over the years. Because of that, RPI is kind of in a transitional phase right now, looking forward to the next phase. And we're working with the government, we're working with uh, local insurance interested groups to become involved, stay involved with the next climate risk initiatives that are trying to be put together on island. We're also working with uh, some universities to try to put together educational programs so that there are properly trained people in the worlds of insurance and in finance that understand climate risk for their uh, insurance products or their investment strategies and things like that. At the end of this year in Scotland, the uh, COP26 meeting of the IPCC will be held and Bermuda, its government and some of its non-governmental groups are working together with other of the uh, UK overseas territories in order to provide a united front of of items that they think need to be addressed better in the climate change problem. And BIAS is working with the, with the local people to try to provide them with any of the scientific advice that they might need going forward.